Hey you guys, welcome back. We are all packed up for the beach again. The kids helped me kind of cut up the fruit and get, I made the sandwiches, but I think kind of we're getting the hang of knowing how to pack our bag and what they want at the beach and then I become more responsible to help out. So, hey Chelsea and Ashley, how come there's towels, coats, and blankets on the stairs? Not where it goes, not where it goes, not where it goes. Chelsea just like drop it down. Oh, well it doesn't, that goes to my bed, that goes in the coat closet, and a towel goes in the hamper I guess at this point. Haley, you're not coming still? Nope, she doesn't have friends that are going and so she's gonna stay home. Ashley, take my blanket to my bed please. Sure. Okay, today we're going to a different beach and I think it's causing some of my kids some anxiety. <laughs> they don't like change but it's gonna be fun. Our friend suggested it and we've just always done the same beach for six years. Six. Ah! <laughs> no, they're hard. He just, okay. he just throwed it right in the yes. All right, so. Mom, oh, you're kicking it. I am kicking it. Oh, that blanket still hasn't made it to my room. That blanket hasn't made it to my bed. Thank you. Um, my bed is this way. Uh, okay, I'm gonna get my swimsuit on and then we will show you the new beach that we're gonna go to today. Should be pretty fun. All right, we are all set. We've got a few extra little floaties today. And so we are going to an island. It's actually only a little ways away from where we are, but my kids kind of got all freaked out a little bit. Be no, the younger ones and Kaylee were worried that we were gonna have to get on a ferry and go out to like Vashon Island or Bay Bridge Island in order to go to the beach today and they forget that there's, oh, hang on. This lady clearly doesn't know how to drive. <laughs> she was on my side of the street. So is this guy. Oh goodness, hang on. Okay, we're back. People were literally driving on the wrong side of the street and parking on the wrong side of the street. And our streets aren't that wide, so <laughs> kind of was annoying. Anyway, but literally we are just going to Mercer Island. So it's the island between the east side and Seattle. We live over on the east side and we cross over Mercer Island to go over to Seattle, go across the 90 bridge, over the water and then over Mercer and then over water again and it's what's called the floating bridge and so we don't often go to Mercer Island just because it's not quite as convenient as the lake that we always go to but our friend wanted to go and do something different and kind of check different things off on her summer list so we're gonna go check this one out and have fun and it's still like super hot outside and it's still water and it's still a beach so she did say that we probably won't have to like lug our stuff down the sand as much, so that will be helpful. So, are you guys excited? Yeah. <laughs> They're so excited. They're, we're just gonna go have fun. While we wait for the moment to pass, I want it to start now, start now. I want this feeling to last. Keep it alive now, right now. It's been too long. The chase has been drawn out enough. I wait till you move on. And we want to turn this to dust. It's been too long.
Abby's right behind me. I can see her floating. Kick my butt and you're dead. Oh, there's a drama right No. No. Turn it off. No. Turn it off. no. <laughs> no. Did you find something, Ashley? Seashells. Let's see. These are so cool. Try and find ones that aren't so broken, like this one right here. That one's cool. Um, you can go wash them off, too. Wow, you found a ton of them. I found some that is together, and I might want to crack them. Can I take these home? Yeah, but I want them washed off. So maybe in the shower, we can figure it out. Maybe we can get a bucket and fill it with water and wash them off. Does that work? Yeah. Okay. What? I found a jackpot. A jackpot? Oh my goodness. That is the jackpot, my friend. Good job, kiddo. found a good parking lot but um, it's really far from the beach so we ended up having to walk a long ways and then when we got to the beach our friend um, was already there and she's like oh my gosh why why did you guys come from that way there's a, a parking lot like literally right around the corner from the beach and so we brought all our stuff to her car and loaded one of the moms into her car with all of her stuff and their kids and they <laughs> run her to her car dump all our stuff off and then the friend will come back to me, get me, and I'll go back and get my car. <laughs> it'll just be easier than having the kids hot, tired, having to walk back in the sun. Because it'll probably take like 15, 20 minutes to walk back. So we're just waiting for a ride. Okay, so while we wait, we realize we're standing here by some blackberry bushes. So we're going to take some little nipples while we wait. That one's kind of yucky. There's some. Mmm, that one's good right there. This is the one I got. Is I it good? Two. I bit through yet. Wait, on the way here. Yeah, I bit through. Yum. I didn't save me. Show me what ones you got. Ooh, you got a lot. Boy. Oh. Yeah, those are good. Just eat them. Ashley's gonna pick them. Put them in her little container, huh? Big ones, so don't get tiny, itty bitty ones. Mm -hmm. Watch out. Getting some. Ooh, there's some really good ones right there, and right there, and right there, and there. Get those really quick, and then I'll load up, okay? All right, you guys, we've got them cleaned up. We've actually had dinner. It's been actually a couple hours. I haven't brushed my hair out quite yet. Um, it's actually, it's not dark outside. It's just really dark in our house, because we try and keep it cool. But Abby and I are in here. Say hi, Abby. 
Nope, she wanna say hi. Oh. So we are going to sit and watch um, Heartland. It is really orange in this room. Sorry, bad light. We haven't been able to change the bulbs in here to the daylight bulbs, so it still looks orange. But we are going to watch Heartland. They finally got a new season on Netflix. I think season 11. And I've been waiting. I actually almost um, signed up for a 30 day trial of Hulu in order to get, hang on, let me put you down. All right, this is not a good angle of me. I just need to pull my hair up. So they, I wanted to get a 30 day trial of Hulu in order to watch this last season with Abby. It's kind of like our show. I don't have too many shows like that that I watch with her. This is like a total boo shot. This is not a good angle. All right, so that's better. So I'm just going to, um, so I almost got a 30 day trial of Hulu in order to watch this last season of Heartland. And then I turned on Netflix last night and suddenly they had the last season available. So I quickly called Abby down and we spent the evening last night watching the first two episodes of, the, of that season. Oh. Anyway, it's kind of fun to watch with her. She almost stole one of the really cold coats from the fridge. So we both have some chips to share and we're gonna sit down and watch a little show. So Jason is on his way home. In fact, I kind of expect him to be coming in any second now. Sorry, going in and out of light here. I expect him home any second if he's not already sitting out in his car. Um, he was at a, he just went to dinner with one of his business partners. It's one of the other owners that own a shoe store as well. We kind of partner up to do marketing and whatnot. Um, so he went to dinner with him and they just haven't, he hasn't gotten back yet. But it's like almost nine o'clock at night. So he's had a really long day. It took him two hours to get to work today because there was an accident and normally it can take him like 25 minutes to get to work. So he ended up kind of staying late to kind of catch up that two hours that he missed of office work and then went to dinner. So he's not even home yet, but he'll be tired when he gets here. I'm gonna turn the air conditioning back on. It is still, last time I checked an hour ago, it's still 81 degrees outside. So hot for Seattle. Super fun day at the beach. Um, that park was really, really fun. Um, never been to that one. Uh, and it's, it's so hard because like we live in a wealthy area here in the, it's, we're not in Seattle, we're out in the suburbs, but it's a really wealthy area. We are not wealthy. <laughs> we live within our means and we do well for ourselves, but by no means are we ever comparable to the people that we live around, especially by where those yachts were, like insane. That yacht is probably like, I don't even know, like $20 million or something. People around here have money to burn and I don't. <laughs> so, um, it's fun to kind of be in that neighborhood, but at the same time, it kind of puts you in your place because we don't have that kind of money. So anyway, we had a good day today. We're going to stay out of the water tomorrow. Kaylee might actually go to the beach tomorrow, but then we have national night out tomorrow night and our like homeowner association does a huge carnival at the park. We went to it last year, right before we went on our road trip to Utah. So you might remember it if you are not new to our channel. And um, I think that's all I'm planning to do with the kids tomorrow. I need the morning to catch up and then I need them to rest and relax after the beach today because we're gonna go to the beach again on Wednesday and possibly again on Friday. So that's it you guys. If you are new, please go ahead and subscribe. We're trying to get our subscriber count up so that we can get to know more of you. Comment, if, especially if you're new. Um, I respond to every comment and I get to know you and you get to know me a little bit better and I think it's really fun. And all of you who do comment, comment and tell people to comment because you know how much fun it is to chat with us. So take care you guys, have a good night and see you tomorrow.
such a fun dog. We have a late night visitor. Hi, Buster. How you doing? Are you tired from a walk? Yeah? <laughs> they can purr. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can I get your leg going? Okay. <laughs>